Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Witcher 3, uh, the Blood and Wine DLC. We are going to be con continuing the uh, Never Fear Skellig is Here quest, so let's head up here. Is that a door? No. How the heck? How do I get in there? Hold on. Let's go over here. I want to check out this, uh, this uh, blacksmith. If I can figure out how to get into these places, like where's the door? Here we go. Wow, this is pretty awesome blacksmith area here. Black, uh, blacksmith store. Okay. Gonna talk to him. Trenton. The best steel in all of Tucson. Take a gander. Show me what you have. You got, you got anything good? Got a bunch of stuff I can't use. What? A war? Oh my god. Level 31. Almost <laughs> level 31. I can almost use some of this stuff. Two sot steel, night steel. It's just a regular steel sword. I want to try this hammer. That's 700 bucks though? Like, really? I could just buy the crappy hammer and see how it goes. That's. Why wouldn't I just buy that? That price difference blows my mind. Why is that such a little. Farewell. No, see you later. Alright. We got another exclamation oh, point. Let's talk. I'm so glad. Wait, this is a quest, isn't it? Like, I already have this thing. Isn't there a vineyard quest? Isn't there... Um... I actually don't. Fine, I'll talk to him. Master Witcher, what luck to happen upon you. Got work for me? New contract? Of the contract in question, you acquitted yourself beautifully years past, on your last sojourn in Beauclair. I was in a bit of a bind at the time, do you remember? Yet I swore a solemn vow to pay you in full one day. Guess it rings a bell. Sadly, you went on your way before I could settle matters with you. So, I took your coin and placed it in an account for safekeeping. Hmm. What kind of account? A savings account at Chanfanelli Bank. You need but walk in and withdraw. The sum must be rather substantial by now. Thanks. Head over there first chance I get. Alright, so... Paper Chase, new quest. Uh, so that was a different quest, and that's for some money. I assume it's not going to be as easy as he said it is, but... Here we go, let's play some Gwent. An armor. The best armor around! That is what I forge! Ah, so sorry. Alright, so what armor mm, do you got? What have you got there? You got any good armor? Or are we dealing with some crap like the last guy's armor I looked at? Uh, this isn't like new armor. That is, but I mean like this isn't new armor. Kind of want to try the Tucson Ducal Guard ar Officer's armor, but that's some expensive stuff for me to just try it, and if I don't like it, that's going to be horrible. I feel like it'll look good. Like, I feel like it would look nice. Uh, I got the money. I guess we can give it a go. Let's try it. Alright, where's the Ducal Guard boots? Is it these, then? No? Are there no boots that go with the Ducal Guard armor? Ducal Guard officer's boots. 31. Uh, this is expensive. I like these pants. And then I think it's these gloves, yeah. No, that's a color guardsman. There we go. Okay. I really like how these look, so we're gonna pick up one of these for Roach. Blinders of the Five Chivalric Virtues. Like, these just look badass. Give me this golden blinders. Like, those just look badass. Let's 
Let's see here. Saddle of the file. Let's get the virtues going on here. Could do the uh, oh saddlebags, Beauclair saddlebags. We'll pick those up as well. Better okay. Let me. Let's just play the Gwent first. I'm gonna be spending all, like all my money in this DLC, Gwent. but that's all good. I don't need it. I guess I saved it up for a reason. It's really easy to make money in this game. So I'm not really all that worried about losing money. I do want to have money at all time though, so I can buy stuff that I want. Okay, this hand is some crap. Other than the fact that I drew the three um, spies, it's a pretty crappy deck. Or it's a pretty not deck. It's a pretty crappy hand. We're just gonna be spying for like five minutes here because he's a Northern Realms deck too with all these spies. Wow, this hand. This hand is like all right. It's not like great, but it's it's all right, I guess. Here in our decoy, which is nice. We take all these back. Is he gonna end his turn? He is. Um. All right, let's do this. Oh, this is ridiculous. The draw power of these decks. It's like it's out of it's out of control. Like it's stupid, ridiculous. Um, let me just do this. And let me play the Crimford Reaver. There we go. Alright, nice. Uh, how do I want to play this? I'm going to lead it off with Triss. I'm assuming he's going to go for draw. I would assume he's got to have at least one or two things that can revive. If he doesn't, that's stupid. Like, what kind of deck did he build? That could be wrong. I would assume he would have played... Why did... I would have played that first, get some draw power and decide what I was going to do from there. But it's a computer. I like... I think of this like, oh, this is an actual person. No, it's a computer, so I should probably think that through before I talk about it. But I feel like the computer should deduce that and figure out that, you know, let me revive my crap first and then I'll go from there. We might be... We might be home free, almost. Yeah, I think we're, we've got this pretty much sealed. I just gotta make sure at no point do I have too many things at the same number. Okay, well that's GG. I just wanna play these for the fun of it. Over 200. 231. Nice. Right, let's go ahead and pass. Take the, take the W. Where did this guy get me? 100 crowns and... Combi. Alright, so now, are we completely done with this area? Okay, so now... Now it's sending us to these, which is fine. We'll go ahead and go there next. Let me equip my new crap for Roach. There we go. So is this better than 60 ho Okay, so it's the same there. The saddle is better, and this is better. I know that. It's 10 more weight I can carry. Alright, so let's get on out of here. What does Roach look like now? Oh, Roach looks badass. You're in Beauclair, see? Come on, Roach. Roach looks badass. All right, let's get on out of the city here. Still, this is this might this is gonna take like three or four episodes. It feels like at this point, it's taking 
Not that I'm upset about that, like, I love playing Gwent and all that, but I thought this wouldn't take this long. Like, I can't play the Gwent tournament after this, because it's going to be, like, six straight episodes of Gwent. As much as most people love Gwent, including myself, that's a lot of Gwent. But I'm happy as long- I'm willing to, like, if this was, like, a 60-part DLC, like, I'm not upset about that. I love this game. I'm interested. Like, when I go and do the revisited, because I'm gonna- I'm gonna do a really in-depth run-through of the game when I do my revisited playthrough, whenever that starts. I'm interested. That thing may hit 200 episodes. That might be like a year and a half thing to get that completed. But it's gonna be like an ongoing thing whenever I decide to do The Witcher 3 Revisited. We're gonna revisit which I don't know, like, I don't plan to like quit this channel, but... I don't know, that might be it for Witcher, because if you think about it, if that takes a year and a half, that's forever. Alright, so actually we have this guy here. And we got a guy right over there. Alright, so... Witcher's rather handsome. Would you I'd assume it'd be Bonnie here. Turn back a river with a rod? No, it's not. Sit. So it's the madam here. Step into my parlor, my good sir. What brings you to Tucson? Tell me. Hmm. Let's call it business. Ah, then. A professional journey. Nothing but work, tension, unfamiliar beds. One needs a way to relax at times. Perhaps my ghost could help you. Actually, some... Uh, let's see here. Okay, let's just point Interested point. in the unusual. Got a special request. Just need to keep this between you and me. You know, well, I shouldn't. Hey, who cares? How might I help? Gwent. You play? I don't think we need to we need to bang any prostitutes today. Oh my gosh. Oh, this handsome. Well shit. This hand is bad. Uh, we might be in trouble with this hand. I'm gonna go for the W here, but this hand may be in some trouble to actually do anything. Uh, let's go with Dandelion. I didn't draw a single spy card, which, which blows my mind that I couldn't draw one out. Okay, he's done. Let me... Hold on, would I still win? If I pull this back, would I still win? It would, minus 16 would be 33, and then minus 8, I think, I should still win, right? Yeah, 25. Alright, give me, give me a spy, please. Thank you. Oh, look, another spy. Oh, this is always good. Northern Realm deck to me is just fun to play. Like, it is the best deck by far, but it's just fun to play more than anything. Uh, let's do this. Bring back Dandelion first. I'm gonna easily win this unless one of these last three cards that she has is good. A commander's horn I don't even think would help her. I don't think she'd even come close. Because I still got way too much power left in my hand. Where it's gonna end. Because my I like to try to get high totals, but like with that I'm not gonna get that high. Oh, she actually is a merchant. Hold on, what card did we get? Mardrome. I got the same card before, didn't I already don't I already welcome, have that? Welcome. Yeah, welcome back. Oh, uh, maybe she's not. Hold on. Wanna let loose. Enjoy myself. Of course. Talk to the girls. 
I'm certain they will do all in their power. And it's quite a lot, believe you me. Welcome, welcome. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cozy place you got. I'm pleased you noticed. You see, when I had set aside enough to found my own establishment, I wished it to be not a body house, but a body home. A place where patrons would not simply come, drop their hose, then flee as soon as the girl rolled over. Here, the sheets do not reek of sweat, the beds have no bed bugs, and the wine is not watered down. It is a place where one longs to linger, to chat, sprawled in a comfortable chair, to light a pipe, all after paying a modest fee, of course. Gotta go. See you later. Alright, I gotta try this. I gotta know if they change this, or if it's still the same old cookie-cutter bullshit. Like, I thought... I wasn't gonna do this, but I don't got. I thought about it. I'm like, I gotta see if this is the same cookie cutter BS that we that we always have had. Um, know how to it. Let's talk to this one. Let's do this. I, I want to see. Did they change this up, or is it still same cookie cutter shit that drove me insane? Oh boy, another one. What's that? Another what? Did Madame Isabel mention role playing costs extra? If you wish to play at being a witcher, then... Misunderstanding, I'm afraid. I am a witcher. Of course. The eyes. I should have noticed. Forgive me, master. Come into my alcove, and I shall more than make up for my error there. The, uh... Playing at being a witcher thing. What's that about? Ah, oh, it's the latest rage. A trick would come, dressed in a studded jacket, two swords on his back, and ask me to play a succubus or a siren. Then he'll say he has a contract, but his codex says he cannot harm a thinking being. So perhaps we can make a deal. Once it's over, he demands some kind of card. I've no notion how it started. They probably took the idea from one of those silly ballads. Mm -hmm. Got a strong suspicion who the author might be. Let's go upstairs. Come. Wait, this gives me experience. <laughs> I gotta see, is it are we cookie cutter BS still? It looks like it's the cookie cutter BS. Yeah, it's still uh, yeah. I think this is still the cookie cutter normal crap. Yeah, it's still the same cookie cutter crap. This is weird watching this while you're recording a video. Yeah, we still got the same cookie cutter crap. This is this isn't something that always that always happens, I don't think. But it is the same cookie cutter sex scene. Peter, like 20 gold. That thing looks like it's got like a thousand gold in it. Just put your lips together and explode. Alright, did this game usually. Before, when you'd have sex, you would lose your stupid gear. Alright, looks like they fixed that. That was the most annoying thing, is when you would lose your gear. Uh, what am I doing? Oh, I'm gonna die from this. Oh, no, I didn't. Okay, we're good. Alright, here we go. What do we got here? A butcher shop? Probably buy some meat from this dude. Meat of the freshest sort! Hot sausage links! Ripe blood pudding! Fine. Show me what you got. Is it all do you all or what what am I trying to say? Yeah, he's just got a bunch of meat. What the heck is this square? Chicken liver pate? The hell? Kinda like this. There's all sorts of different people selling crap. 
There's like a ton. There's a ton of new stuff. Like there isn't a butcher in the regular no, game. No, you're busy, but you up for a round of Gwent? All right, let's do this. Okay. Wow. Okay. Oh, right. It is spy galore. Might just keep this hand. Yeah. Let me ditch the scorch. Okay, that's good. Let me just ditch the commander's horn. That's not a bad hand. All right. This is the best hand I've drawn while recording. I drew like an otherworldly hand one time. It was straight ridiculous. That was the 300. This I might be able to get the 300. I'm gonna need to draw some more blue stripe commandos. Cause that's not happening right now. All right, there we go. Bed. All right, nice. All right, so I can start playing these. So I can revive. Okay, let's do this. And my turn. Give me another blue stripe. Uh, okay, I'll take that too. Um, I gotta play this smart. Start it out this way. Okay, good. No scorch off the bat. Nice. That means I can revive, or I can. Okay. Do I want to do that? I'm at a. We're at a little bit of a crossroads here. I'm gonna do it. That probably was a mistake. I'm not gonna get to over 300 now. Well, maybe I can. No, I lose too much by doing what I did. Interesting play. Alright, let's start bringing another crap back. You know what? Actually, I think I, actually we might be good. Oh, no, that fucks over right there. Shit. I think I had the 300. I might have had the 300. There's like a... I'll see what my total comes to. We'll do the math. I might have had the 300. We'll see. Yeah, well, I don't know. I would have been close. Well, that kind of ruins that completely now. Oh, this is actually really close. Actually, this is really close. I have a Scorch, so... rip. Alright, let me... let me do the math here. Um... So we got four. So, so base we have 89. I had four more. If you double all their strengths, that's 24, right? That would be... it goes 4, 8, 12, 16. So it would be 16 times 4... 64, and then he doubled that. We would have been... Yeah, this would have been a 300. Yeah, this would have been a 300. But that's alright. I always find it fun, like, trying to get the 300. Alright, now we're pretty far away. Skellige Storm is the card that we acquired. Where is Roach? Why are you over here in the market, Roach? Russians... All right, we'll do one more Gwent. We might do two if there's like two right next to each other wherever I'm going now. Because there probably is. They kind of clustered them up. Hold on, let me see if there's anything like a question mark on the way. And there is not. All right. Do what they summoned you to do, then pack up and go back. That's it, I can't run anymore. Yeah, I can't run anymore. So we just did- we get a relaxing trot. 
But yo, Ro Roach looks badass now. That armor was worth every dollar I spent. I didn't even try the guardsman armor on. We'll do that when we get to this location. I just forgot about that. I didn't even try that armor on that we bought. It's either going to look clean or it's going to look like trash. My bet is on it's going to look straight trash, but we will see. Alright, there's that. Actually, that's not bad. It ain't great looking, but it's not horrible. Like, I'm not gonna say it's like a 10 out of 10, but... That's not bad. We'll wear it. We'll wear it. Not bad. Alright, armor. Armor chromed, engraved or fluted. Whatever your hearts desire. Oh, what you got? Let's see what you got in stock. It just bought armor, so don't really need to buy more. And color guardsmen. There's so many. There's ducal guardsmen, ducal guard officer. It's just all sorts of armor going on out here. Guess we'll probably just wait. This helm. This thing looks so sweet. Like, there's such sick armor for Roach in this. Is there anything I can sell? I don't think so. I haven't, I haven't done anything. No, I haven't, like, done anything. There shouldn't be anything. There's no items to repair. Okay. Time for some Gwent. And this will end this episode. But you up for a round of Gwent? Yeah, shake your head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want a 300 in this video. Or in, like, this series. Hmm, let's hand some dookie. Uh, yeah, this hand some crap. I don't think we're going... We'll win with this hand, but I don't think we're getting close to 300. I'm gonna need to draw a spy here, if we're gonna smell 300. Nope. That'll just about do- oh, no, no, okay. Hmm, how do I want to go about this? I don't think I want a decoy. I'm gonna end my turn. I'm gonna let him take this. Alright, this is fine. Oh my gosh. Dude, he just hit- he just hit me with the- with way too many spies. That's ridiculous. I have spies left in my deck and I can't draw them. I'm surprised he took that L last round. I wouldn't have taken that if I was him. Gave me another decoy. It's getting a little out of hand here. I still have two spies left in my deck that I can't draw. I'm not able to draw right now. I can't get them. Like, I'm just struggling to draw them out. I think I, I have one more decoy, too. Oh, there's a spy. Oh, there, I like, drew both of them. Nice. my other decoy. <laughs> this hand is out of control. This, this whole Gwent battle right here is just straight out of control. Well, I finally, all of this came to an end. Kind of. Only we're still- I have 18 cards in my hand. This is ridiculous. Freaking 18 cards. I'm going to have 19 cards in my hand after this. I drew Yen and I can't even use her. Can't even use her ability. 
Oh, that was that was a mistake, my friend. Think about all those 18s. Well, this hand is officially ridiculous. Alright, it's time to just roll all this out. He's... This actually, this won't be close at all, but I think I might get 300 here. This is, the, this is the most fun hand I've had in any of these so far. Getting this many cards to my hand. There's only two left, and I actually need the two. The cards that are left in my deck is the other Crinford Reaver and the other Catapult. If I could have drawn those, this, was, this hand would have been, re been even more out of control. Let's get rid of that. I just want him to run out of cards, like, oh, you, oh, you know what, you know what, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> that actually works out well, thank you. Give me the last two cards in my deck. Yeah, this is gonna be, this may be the highest I've ever had, because this is gonna get ridiculous. I'm literally going to have every single card in my deck on the field. Like, every monster card in my deck is going to be out here. Dude, this could be... This is going to close in on, like, 400. Yo, this is... This is stupid. <sighs> oh my gosh. 333. What's this? 353. This is ridiculous. 390. 390. That is unbelievable. 390. I can't believe it. That is crazy. And I think that's a good place to call it an episode. That is freaking ridiculous. I didn't actually think you could get it that high. But we got Skellige Storm. We got 11 out of the 19 cards, but that is going to do it for this one. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace out.